Okay, oh, okay, I'm starting to remember. All oh, right, this was the course that I was struggling to see the um, rough with. That's right. All right. So, again, the, the sculpting of the fairways, I would like to see a little smoother, probably. I think I mentioned that in the beta. It's a little better, though. Uh, then, yeah, here's an example of it. We're blind from 140, well, 119 yards, I guess. Just this stuff here. For me, if I'm starting to see shadows because of the ridges, I'm starting to wonder if that's maybe a bit steep. Um, I don't mind the green size for the length of the hole. And I, the hills on it are pretty good. That bunker just kind of... It, it, I guess, I mean, and the, the way that that hill there makes that bunker no fun at all. Okay. Hmm, just needed that to spin a little bit. Okay, and then from here, it's a reasonably flat putt. So one thing I can definitely tell is we've changed the um, the texture of the grass, so it's much easier to tell what's fair or what's rough. And I believe this course doesn't have light rough. I feel like that was the case. All right. So then we got the false front here. I think I remember this hole too. Um, I like this pot on the right. That bunker probably comes into play more than you think it would because of the hill. Um, but for a back pin, it really wouldn't. Uh, the rocks on the left, are, eh, I'm not sure. Rocks on the left are kind of hiding that bunker, and the water there is just kind of there. Um, where's it coming from? Well, there's a waterfall. Where's that water coming from for the waterfall? I think it just seems to. coming from under the rock where's that anyways um <laughs> yeah Maddie well it, the thing that would really blow Maddie's mind would be a waterfall with a um, island green so I'm gonna try and get a bit greedy here oh that thing went forever I shouldn't have de-lofted that. Okay, the green. I mean, the one that it, it looks just the 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 grass and everything looks a lot better. Grubbler, how are we going? Coming in hot with a uh, quote. Love it. Okay, yeah, it's visually it's much more appealing. That's the one thing I'm gonna keep saying, I think. Um, yeah, sculpting here is just a little bit, just a little harsh in places. And then this one's drivable, okay. Um, the grass in front there, I'd like to see that knocked down a bit so we can see the green a bit better or raise the T, one of the two. Um, Yeah, we did, Grubbler, that's right. It, it, it definitely has uh, improved. There's no question about that. Um, I can't hit a full driver here. Partial one up there and hope for the best. So then strategy-wise, if we pull up the overhead, I guess you've got that waste stuff to the right, but I mean, you do have to carry all of it to go at it. So I could, maybe there's a reason to lay up. It, it's not the hardest um, drive, like taking driver at it hole I've seen, but 
Doesn't have to be either. And if I'm repeating myself from the video I did before, I apologize, but um, I often don't remember what I did 10 minutes ago, never mind, um, you know, a few days ago. Yeah, I know, I had the knockdown driver, or the, the partial driver. Standard shot. Okay, yeah, I remember these bunkers, that's right. Yeah, the bunkers are just, maybe that, maybe not. I was going to say something, and then I decided not to, because I don't think it's true. Um, this might not get a bounce. Well, this might be fine, actually. I could, I could have seen that kicking really hard left off of there. Yeah, they do. Lucas, how's it going? Uh, yeah, 1 o'clock's kind of my time now. Now that the kid's in school. Um... Uphill. Yeah, this looks nice. This looks nice. Just yanked it a bit. I get to go visit this pot, probably. Oh, no, not, not quite. What do we got? Pretty heavy. It's kind of come flying out of here. Oof. I think so, Grubbler, yeah. This is one where he was trying to make it like Pete die. Um, again, I, for me, my preference would be for the, 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 like this, that's just a little bit sharp for my liking. I don't think we need to have that extreme a um, sloping. Like it, the, the sloping is creating shadows, which to me is kind of not a bad indicator, not a bad way to figure out is it uh, is it too sharp. If we can see shadows, then it probably is. Really cool look from the tee, though. Let me just aim where the pin would be. That looks really nice. The bridge is there. I'm not really going to look at it much because I'm not all that bothered about whether it's structurally sound or whatever. Ooh. You old push hook there. Soften the slopes a bit with a page four fuzzy brush, maybe. Yeah. Now I think here the idea was if you go left, then you've got a view of the green, and if you go right, you don't. Which I'm fine with. I think that's what I remember it being. Green, this green complex is pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, it's solid. You can definitely see he's done some work since the beta. Get over there. Boom. Did he get rid of the water tower? <laughs> well, Luke's had spoken, so he's like, I best get rid of that. Okay, so we got a pond there. Yeah, I just, that look is really quite cool. Um, again, if you're playing straight, you're going to go there. I'm fasting it, so I'm going to hook sling one. I don't get quite as good of a look, but that's that's me. That's, that's because of how I've chosen to play it. Um, yeah. Just very clean. And then... We can bash it up here. Yeah, it does. It does, Adam. That's what he was going for. See if we can run it up the gap here. Gives us that opportunity to do it. It's not easily done, but oh, I maybe didn't want to get onto the green now. Oh, look at this.
Greens show potential. Yeah, they do. The, the greens are they're thought out pretty nicely. Um, I forget how many designs he's done. I want to say this is his second. There's an easy way to find out. I'd have to go looking through the. Uh, I'd have to go looking through the um, work in progress thread. But I think I feel I feel like like it, it, he hasn't made very many. Let's just put it that way. I like the uh, aiming post that was back there. Little bitty fairway here. Yeah. Okay. I was gonna get a bit cranky there, but no, that's not bad. It is quite narrow, but it's also short, so makes sense. I like that he hasn't gone, especially being a relatively new designer, he hasn't gone crazy with trying to make like spectacular um, elevation changes and cliffs and all that kind of jazz. He's just created a nice solid um, desert themed course. It's got a cool vibe, I agree with Grublar. All right, we gotta look at this bridge because that's quite the bridge. Oh no, it's not a bridge, it's just a path with the uh, railing, okay. Well, now I'm not as interested. Uh. This is a cool look too. It is a solid effort for sure, Scoot, you're right. You can definitely see where he's um, made some improvements from the beta, which is awesome to see. The one thing I really like about In Your Rear View too is that um, he seems to have a really good attitude about this. Um, he seems like he's requesting feedback, he's listening to it. Um, he's not incorporating all of it and that's fine because it's his course. Everybody has opinions. But he's definitely, um, yeah, this is, uh, this is In Your Rear View's course, yeah. Uh, but he's definitely he, he's taking feedback that he's act, he's requesting which is cool and then he's using it and he's creating better courses out of it so yeah it's really cool he's definitely not one of the misunderstood geniuses that uh, pop up every now and then I'm starting to see that a bit more in the um, course you know not quite completed courses or courses in const under construction I think that's a sub thread anyways I'm seeing more people now asking for beta plays through play through sorry which is which is neat to see that's a cool way to get some ideas for your course the not approved thread it can be yeah uh, it's unfortunate too um, I don't really like making fun of people but yeah, there's just some people that come in like they know everything and they forget this is the TGC Tours forum and TGC Tours is has decided they want courses to be a certain way to be in their database. And so you either make your courses that way or you don't have them in your database. It's simple. Um, they just want to come in and, and create issues it seems like. so. I like the vibe here too, the, 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 the kind of the little, they're not mountains, but kind of deserty hills kind of things. Um, I mean, this could be partial, I guess, but there's not, no real reason not to three wood either. Yeah. Yeah, but ultimately it's their site, right? And they've decided this is what we consider to be a good golf course. These are the, this is the criteria by which we judge golf courses. Um, 
And so if yours does not fit this criteria, we're not going to put it in our database. Totally they're right. I don't understand why people get mad about that. I really don't. Okay, so we've added a waterfall, I think, to this. I don't think that waterfall was there before. I might have missed it. Again, kind of curious where the water's coming from, but it's a joy of a video game, right? Uh, I want to be careful here, otherwise I'm going to be swimming in there. Of course, the 28 unintentional blinds get shot down the crater. Excuse me, I thought this was America. Yeah, it is. Well, it isn't for me, but... You have every right to create whatever course you want, and TGC Tours has every right to um, say they don't like it. <laughs> All right? Maybe a hot spring scoot. I'm not sure. Um, again, I, that's the kind of thing some people get wound up about. Like where? The, and I was just curious. I'm not certainly wouldn't change my my opinion of a course because of stuff like that. I'm just curious. Just another neat look. We've got some bunkers around here. We've got a backstop, which is going to help us. But if you ever went in that bunker, you wouldn't enjoy it. So that's kind of neat. Um, the putts themselves are. I haven't had a whole lot of. Oh, that's going to come back. Is it? Yeah. I haven't had a whole lot of big breaks in my in the putts, so it's playing a bit easy. But that's fine. Yeah, this good hole. Another good hole. There's a lot of solid holes here. Um, let me just hang here for a sec. I just, yeah, I like the look of this too. Well, we got par, oh, it's a par four. Okay. Just take it right over that. How far back were those bunkers? So from where I am now. Sixty yards back from where I finished up, they feel like they're more in play for three wood than a driver, unless it's the wind. The wind would make it different, maybe. Um, that bunker, I don't love its placement. That one's not so bad, but again, I mean, if you're in the rough, those are going to come into play, I guess. And then this fairway over here. Hmm. Oh, there's a bunker there, too. Okay. Not entirely sure what we're doing there, but that's okay. The lighting's really cool. I like, I mean, I just, I love watching the ball in the sky. That's why I took the ball trail off, because I like to see the ball just in the, in the sky. And the lighting's letting me see that which is a me thing, but I like it. Oh, hey, Lisey, sorry, I missed you there. Uh, this is Rear Views, that's right. Yeah, um, I played the beta of it last week, and then I thought, now that he's published, let's give it a go. Um, so, yeah, again, these bunkers are more in play for a layup. Not really in play for driver, for me at least, with this driver. But, no, they wouldn't be in play for any driver. Yeah, sculpting is a gross personal preference for sure. Um, it is what he wanted, so. And then I think this hole, if I'm to the right, then I, I think I remember if I'm to the right of this um, fairway, then I get to look at the green, and if I'm not, I don't. I remember that, because last week I couldn't tell what was green and what was sorry, what was rough and what was fairway, but he's, he's changed the texture, so it's easy, you can tell now. So. Good strategy. You got to keep it right to have a look at the green. 
Uh, that downhill lie really made it go. Hmm. Chipping them in for fun today, my goodness. We're on 59 watch, boys. Um, bounce it off the bridge? Nah. 390. It's just a cool look. Um, this should run down there. Close to the end of the fairway. With it being downhill. Yeah, that's fine. I didn't mean like all the way down there, but f far enough. Okay. Again, we kind of have the fairway wrapping around, and I'm not entirely sure why. Um, yeah, I agree with Adam there. I think where it's really aggressive you notice it but then you kind of don't so take my putter my head cover off the putter this time maybe push the crap out of it okay 59 washes over Surfacing doesn't match as well as it could with does. Uh, then again, the weakest. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm guessing it takes a lifetime to get good at this. Um, okay, I remember this hole. What is it to the end? It's 360. If I get it that far, then I deserve to. Like, I'll take being in the bunker. Yeah, there's just a few places where it's, you can just bomb everything, and I don't, I don't think it's just. A, it might be partly the driver. I, f I feel like he said something about that in his beta thread too. So he wasn't taking into account the driver that I had. Oh no 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 no! That's poor. That's just a poor shot. Mm. No, you're right, Grubble Art, for sure. Yep, for sure, Lisey. Um, it's his course, and so you're right. He, he liked it, he kept it. We said, mm, I'm not so sure about that. And he said, well, I am. So, suck it. I went, okay. <laughs> um, it's a cool look. Place hazards at identical distances every time anymore in an ideal world. That's true. Hey there, Manti. How's it going? Yeah. Now yeah, this hole does look nice. The whole course does actually. This is um, in your rear views, Loki Valley. He just published it last night. What is that? Mm. That swing plane is, or that putting plane is bugging me. There we go. It's 
a five. Yeah, I just I mean every tee shot looks really cool. I'm gonna take it over the bunker there. And then uphill, uphill lie. Eh, let's be silly. You like drivers off the deck, Rubler. Here you go. Oh, that's got some heat on it. Easy. Okay, I didn't need to hit that. Uh, okay. This will come screaming out of that lie, but then I don't know about the rough. Like the downhill, I mean, but then the rough. Ooh, almost. That's right, no layup allowed. It's a video game. Especially when I'm just doing this. If I'm playing a tour event, then I might lay up, but... It's good to know there, Grubbler. I'm glad to see you're feeling all right. So this is potentially drivable downwind, I imagine. Again, nice, just nice clean look to the holes. He hasn't gotten overly ambitious, but he hasn't created a dull course either, if that makes sense. He's created a nice course that has some character to it, but doesn't like have any stupidity to it really. The green brown context context is really good. The first thing I noticed was um, the textures were so much better. Like the coloring, sorry. Um, you can see that you, there's a the, the fairway to the rough to the brown is it's very clear. It's very good. Um, I enjoy it. There'll be people that don't like the some of the extreme, ex, more extreme. Um, sloping in areas it's what he wanted so that's fine um i didn't miss a fairway that's pretty impressive it's just good i mean it, it's it's it it would be a challenge circuit course if it if it got to tour worthy um because it's just it's not very difficult but it's 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 good it's really good again i like i like seeing the progression from the beta to now and it was only a few days it's really cool how much it's just changed in those couple of days. It's so much um, easier to play it, like, easier to see where you're going. Just a good, clean desert course. Really good job, man. We'll be putting this in the thread because it's nice.